So what's up guys, uh, welcome back, this is your boy Gadam Slink, how you guys doing, good morning, afternoon, evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from, I have my stage partner here, celebrity, honorable, local man, thank you for joining us today, and uh, we had what is happening in Ghana, to so our Ghana's uh, brothers and sisters who are gays over there, who are LGBTQ, I don't know, local man, do you sympathize with them, because a new law now has just been established in Ghana to make sure anybody promoting anything that is related to lgbtq or identifying with them we get up to three years in prison i support hey why we support them i support the government <laughs> and i'm waiting at the expert with nigeria to right away nigeria. i mean what share share you share you the middle of this shit i don't know the rainbow be this one multiple <laughs> color rainbow, multiple color but yeah. this is lgbtq color so now nah, I need to avoid the video too. <laughs> we no come, we no come, we no combo me from back. <laughs> I'll do you waiting for that. You do, uh, um, <laughs> boy, boy. But but meanwhile, guys, you know, uh, when I was growing up, eh, uh, when I used to see rainbow, uh, rainbow signify something like a promise from God. Yeah, yeah. You understand yeah, yeah. love and everything. You no, know, it makes you happy. Oh, look at rainbow, look at rainbow. I don't know why they decide to come change rainbow. What the rainbow stand for? Oh, they change their mind now. Over the years, because rainbow color yeah. stands for LGBTQ color. Yes, yes, yes. That is their flag. <laughs> no, first time I hear this. That's their flag. Go check LGBTQ. Oh. If you go go on, their flag is rainbow color. Well, no, but... Over the years, man, in the next fifty years, eh? In the next fifty years, children no go understand. Say rainbow color, na rainbow color. That one they share. If they see rainbow, they will say, oh, na God already. Professor, I say LGBTQ will come into the world. <laughs> you know, so, so that white people they, they by that time they don't brainwash them. <laughs> now, that's so why white people they, they small, 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 small. Enter you. you think you know, ah, it's not even possible. But by the time we don't buy 100 years, we don't buy those children, made they grow, make, make we don't born. They don't understand the history. So now the story they go, they tell them, they go and the story made they tell it's them, possible. they don't believe. Like us now in Nigeria, we don't know may, many of our stories. We don't know even know that. You know, now, know white man story. Me, what you tell me about this color now? Mm. To me, a rainbow. I don't know if they don't turn into something else. They don't. Uh, they don't turn. And meanwhile, guys. Uh, firstly, I know we have a human fundamental way of living. We have a fundamental human right. Firstly, we have fundamental human right. And you know, once you choose democracy, democracy is what the life of the people and for the people, for the people. and by the people. people. That's what uh, democracy stands for. And in any country that is practicing democracy, then I think the people have the right to make their choices. Yeah. You know, and it, democracy is won by numbers. The majority of people who say we do not want this thing, that thing should go to them. You understand? Yeah. So I think, Ghana, I don't know how you people are feeling about it all. I don't know uh, the LGBTQ over there. I don't know why, what you guys are feeling. I don't know how it is with you guys over there. But according to the news yesterday, they said Ghana Parliament has passed an anti-LGBTQ bill. The bill prescribed a three-year J term for identifying as LGBTQ and a five years imprisonment for promoting LGBT activities. Making eight years. <laughs> che. Combination of uh, eight. eight years imprisonment for all the offenses combined together. I love that. You know, in Nigeria, our law say if you are involved in any activities that is against the natural order, yeah. you will go for to it. jail. And that is not even specific. That is why you see. The likes of Bob Brisky, J. Boogie, make it they confuse you. <laughs> J. Boogie made they confuse our very local man. Uh, that's why you see them still striving in Nigeria. Because honestly, Nigeria do not have. Nigeria do not kick against LGBTQ. Nigeria government do not say anything about LGBTQ. Because we have so many things in Nigeria that is bothering us, Abi. Because when Nigeria government won't focus on that one, we'll tell, say, no, 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 focus on LGBTQ. Focus on... Hunger. Hunger. Focus on giving us light. 
before you start focusing on uh, irrelevant issues. Honestly speaking, eh, if federal government talks to the one the to a slight LGBTQ will lie, I will tell them say, make the go sit down. I will support them. Make the go sit down because I know that job. I don't want the. I know that job and I know that girl light. Don't want the bona part of our problem. Do me be that. Because if you check out this thing for Nigeria now, mm -hmm. you don't need to turn to normal thing for our face. Imagine our children when they come out up now, mm -hmm. they will sound as normal thing. Mm -hmm. So by the time government keep quiet for this thing, before you know they don't get they don't get grand. Because I've been people like Bobrisky, what do you call that one now? Jay Boogie. Jay Boogie Jay and Brown. Jay Brown. When they even get, they, they come outside, they let you know, say, yeah, this is what we are doing. You, they work out for, see, you see young guy, they work out like come on, pent mount, pent end. So, it, which means they are free. And by the time they continue this thing, the upcoming children too, oh, well, I like the way with that guy, they dress, they dress that woman, I will follow that footstep. I like the way with that woman, they do. As in, before you know, you go turn to, we know because to me they are not normal to tell you the truth. And you see those people, people will get psyched. To me. So now before you know now, you know you go you will say half for force this is or normal, mm -hmm. half for for not the normal. Because every time you say person like but whiskey, um but whiskey why not call the normal to me. But they get money now. It's not about the money to me now. We are not talking about money. You know we say now I noticed one thing they gave for this life. Now bad thing. They get as in a bad how put them. Bad behavior. Yeah, bad behavior money they enter quick. Because, don't know why because some... of uh, the human beings on living on this side. So, they like bad, bad things. So on a very good day, imagine bro, which is one is the brand, the million we they get for account, man. I know which sure that I don't touch one one single one part of it. If I may speak this thing, uh, uh I don't know. Uh look at my am I free to talk something about you? Yeah, why why not? Am I free? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, you know, say uh, LGBTQ people, uh, they, they dress like women, Abi. Yeah. People may they identify as them. Yeah. Why men, women, they dress like men? Yeah. Mm. You don't pierce your ear before? For sure. Yes. Why you pierce your ear? That was a normal fashion to me. Ah, uh, the normal fashion to you. Yeah. <laughs> a no. normal fashion to no, you. you. It, okay, okay, okay. Ask your question, Phil, because am I am I free to uh, go deeper? Bro, ask question. Yeah, yeah, am ask, I free to go ask, deeper? Ask question, yeah. You pierced your ear before, Abi? Yeah, I pierced my ear before. Is it uh, in religion or any teaching of our forefathers fathers that a man should wear earrings? Bro, it's not, I, I said it before. I said not fashion. You saw it as a point of fashion, Abi. Yeah. What of the likes of uh, J Boogie, Jess Brown, mm -hmm. and Bob Risky? Doing their lipo section and everything. Mm. Well, what they tell you say they see on like fashion? Yeah, they may see it as fashion to based on their own mentality too. And hence though, why are you condemning them? <laughs> I will condemn them because we are far far different. How are you far different from piercing your ear? Wait, no. Nobody say blood wait, come outside. Wait. You want to be identifying as a woman. Wait. You no. pierce your ear. No. Why you pierce your ear? Because when you find a bit. Wait, wait. May you rugged. We are different. How are you doing? Now, nah, wait now. If I be, how will I put it now? Uh, if I be gay, let me put it that way. Let me go point now. Now, there for the start. Okay, if I be gay, uh, even you will avoid me. Why you feel like, uh, okay. Even you, when me, I know. How am I know you are not gay because you pierce your ear? Uh, because I, if you say you want to judge me by ear, man, you go ahead and judge me. <laughs> Talk. Because me, to me, let me tell you uh, the truth. The likes of their Bob Risky, Jess Brown, yeah. and them, they can go to court and say, we see guys who pierce their ears. Yeah. We see other guys when they draw tattoo for body. Yeah. They, they go through that pain. Ear, blood, they come outside. Yeah. We they will see guys, they be like, say, nowadays, they, they come off fat from their body at part. Eh, something. We doing all those kind of stuff. It's also fashionable to, to, to us. Okay. So what makes you think that a man who can pierce his ear or plate his air like a woman mm. is better than somebody who want to have this uh, massive uh, boobies mm. who, who want to have to his nyan should taste an LGBTQ. Papa, we are far far different. <laughs> Imagine me as I sit down here, you know. Imagine say Bobby did my front. I will see you as every other guy made the plate. I will, I will treat you not the same. If Bobby did my so as hearing, oh no matter I know the way is hearing again. Uh, but if you say I wear hearing now, you see my eyes. Yes. So now, right now, you see me as them now. Yes. 
Man, what's in here for you? <laughs> You are part of them. No, 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 no. <laughs> you are you part see, of them. You see when you are talking of tattoo and I know some people may not like it. <laughs> Me, I sell my fashion. You mm -hmm. see my tattoo and my ear my bow. Eh? I sell my fashion to me. Since I don't go further to do my bum bum, I don't go further to do my boots. And I believe you the, can do all those you things. Say, uh, uh, I know if you show you, I know if you show you my hand, which maybe you be done white or not. Chat. So, <laughs> <laughs> now you ask question now. So, bro, you know, I there is different, there is different you. between... We, those rumors are the year about you. Which one is the guy? You fight trouble. I tell you, you fight trouble. Uh, so, me, I just see my own uh, as fashion, to tell you the truth. So, let's go uh, further, guys. Uh, you know, uh, Nigerians, uh, Nigeria government, Tunubu government, are trying as much as possible to make sure they reduce this dollar. Yeah. Hmm? yeah. They reduce these people who are doing all those corner corner businesses with uh, Nigeria. You know, let us be honest, this dollar crisis, uh, apart from production and everything, is not ordinary. Yeah. There are cabals fighting it. Let's be honest. Oh, and, you know. The cabals are also in the government. We know that quite all right. So, Binance, you don't know much about Binance. Binance is a cryptocurrency platform okay. for trading and buying dollars and everything. Binance say eh, that they are among the regulatory body. No, we say that they are more, but because of their platform and because of their exposure and the people who are into transaction in their own platform, okay. eh, that they are among those few companies, those few entities in the world that can influence the currency of the world. Okay. So and now, their constant price, their recent price of uh, the dollar now versus Nigeria is high. Meanwhile, you see Bill the cry say, ah, how this city the high like this? This one will set up its own uh, regulatory body, say this one high, like uh, for Binance, you'll see so-so amount. For Nigeria CBN, you'll see different amounts. So they, they fight each other. Okay. Federal government can invite Binance executive called Nigeria. Say, okay. me the, me the uh, interact. interact and work this in out. As soon as they learned Nigeria yesterday, they did to go to, we arrest them, seize their passport. One, one from UK, one executive from UK, and one executive from uh, USA. Okay. He arrests them, seize their passport. Why? So according to uh, according to presidential aid, Bayo, he said, if we do, if we don't clamp down on Binance, Binance will destroy the economy of this country. They just fix the rate. We have sabotage. Look at what Binance is doing to our economy. That is why the government move against Binance. So people sit down using cyberspace to uh, dictate even our exchange rate, hijacking the rule of CBN. They just sit down and fix anything they like. It's a sabotage. And we are trying to prevent that from happening. Honestly, it's true. Why won't you fix uh, why won't you fix uh, dollar rate according to our CBN? Yeah. Did, did you, did, you know, Nigeria got a blast if not the arrest, eh, I don't think it's called for. But Nigerians now the person that don't even know about Binance. Someone that never done trade it before or cryptocurrency trade it before is blasting the government. You know why? Nowadays, eh, without anybody understand why bless it without anybody understand anything, they'll just blast government. Why? Mm, a of, uh, lack of knowledge shit to now because because if you know what you are doing, you won't you know where to face. Please, Nigerians, before you blast, eh, understand why you did blast. No, nah, lack of knowledge. Eh? That's why Jesus Christ told say, before you cast the stone, I, at least know why you want to cast stone now, and know if you have duty or not. How can a company outside abroad, from USA, UK, outside abroad, dictating your exchange rate Wait. that is different from the CBN? It's very wrong. I, I, at least, comply with the CBN, Abi. Comply with the CBN. Make could make, make could they interact. So that being said, did you guys know last month USA government sued Binance for four billion US dollars and they paid? Wow. For sabotage. So why can't Nigeria sue Binance? Why can't Nigeria arrest uh, uh, hold them accountable there? Because we are small as a country, 
Is that why you are looking at us like that? No, that's the right thing to do then. Is it because we are small as a country? Then they say, oh, Nigeria do not have that right. But the USA government sued Binance and got a $4 billion from them. Let's be honest now as country. Eh? Let's be honest. Injury the right thing for seizing their passport. Let them, uh, they shouldn't be fixing our, see this thing they touch like me. We all already know, say, sabotage day. Eh, forget. If you know what is happening, you will know that Kabaz are fighting back. Yeah, Buhari said that corruption, like the fight back pass. But him, Buhari was eaten by the corruption. Yeah, yeah. He's corruption. He tried to fight them. Eh? Oh, yeah, he corruption can't. swallow him. He can't even, he not even know where he belongs again. He, he, he called the enable corruption. He no not know the enable corruption. <laughs> he said, give them freedom. <laughs> he said, give the parliament freedom. But you are enabling it. Well, uh, so is there anything you want to say? No, no, no. About the giveaway. Did you see the uh, the pre presidential convoy? No. Buhari pre pre presidential convoy. <laughs> uh, so I said, Buhari Tunubu, sorry. No, sir, long. Plenty. Mika, Mika, say well. But we don't reduce our arms. Someone said, we are talking about reducing the cost of governance. Yet, President Tinubu is moving with 41 vehicles just to transport the president to of a country. <laughs> 41. Ilongo. Ilongo. 41. It's, well, it's much. That's it, guys. And uh, is there anything? They give away the timing. Okay, okay, okay. The give away time. We are going to go live on Adam Slink Media. Adam Slink Media for the giveaway. Please try as much as possible to tune in. And uh, try, just try to tune in, guys. For today. For today. Today. For Nigeria time. 4 p.m. today. Yep. 4 p.m. today. So thank you guys for watching the boy Adam Slink. I'm a celebrity local man here. Thank, thank you. you.